Hello everybody and welcome back to Beta Days. I'm Beanin and today I have somewhat of a whimsical uh, task for us in Riverton. Today I would like to build an old castle. Well, a little, a small little castle in the woods over here. I've gone ahead and cleared some area and I don't know, I think it'd just be a fun thing to do. So sit back, relax and enjoy today's episode as we build a small little castle in the woods. I think it'll be something that's, you know, just fun to do. Um, and, you know, add to uh, our, uh, our you know, world. <laughs> I don't know why I struggled with that so much. If you didn't catch last episode, we went ahead and built a covered bridge over our channel that's off in that direction. Uh, and we also created a little auto smelter for our mob farm that, you know, Kind of makes it easier to deal with the crap loot that comes out there. You know, just want to get the gold nuggets um, for it. Because now it's essentially a gold farm. Um, it's a very inefficient gold farm, but it's a gold farm nonetheless. So without further ado, please remember to leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe. I post videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday with random streams and videos in between. Now, I already have some thoughts uh, in mind and some preliminary designs in my head i know i want to do a combination of you know cobblestone stone uh some mossy cobblestone maybe even some mossy stone bricks i did get a good tip about the uh how to farm moss and how i can use them on stone bricks to you know make some mossy stone bricks so we can go ahead and uh start working with that but before we get started i'm gonna go ahead and grab these tools just because we may need them um this isn't going to be a crazy big build but i think it'll be a fun build i want to have kind of the same look that i've got going here uh but i don't mm, no i don't want to i want a wooden <laughs> a wooden roof but i want like kind of like somewhat like this look on one side and then almost a I don't know, uh, like a little tower. It doesn't have to be big like that, but enough to stick above the trees and be like, oh, what's that, you know? Uh. Now, you may be thinking, oh, is this a new place of living? And sort of, it's somewhere I can go that's, you know, close by if I want to just, you know, have some, uh, a breakup of scenery um, or just have something to look at as I go down my path. Uh, we're going to need, yeah, that seems like, yeah, that seems good enough. So you take that. We're going to need some. Eh, I don't know. We're going to need bigger living spaces, but I have a plan for that. And it'll involve like kind of like a mansion, a manor. This is kind of just like, ah, this was the castle that existed before Riverton. Um, not exactly abandoned, but, you know, not brand new. So we're going to go ahead and I've gone and cleared out this little lot, this little area. It seems like a perfect little section in the woods for a castle. And I realize that some of the trees here are still, eh, whatever. I was going to say some of the trees here are a little in the way, but that won't be a big deal. And now we can just, yep, clear out this little area and get to start or get started on our well, our little castle. Let me just go ahead and put that there. Toss you down right here. No, nope, don't want the sticks. Let's see, I think yeah, I think dirt would be a good one. Clean up this area. Oh, that was it. <laughs> Sweet. Okay, well I'm gonna lay out a basic little castle keep uh floor plan and then we'll go from there all right so i've started the little i guess yeah basement um down here and i think it's going to look good so far um yeah i might change the floor plan we'll see how it turns out but i don't know what one thing i've learned with castles is that you know the more improvised they are at least with my building skill set 
uh, the better they look. And remember, this isn't like some big grand castle. This is just like a little stone keep in the woods that, you know, was once, I don't know, a little outpost, something like that. Um, the lore is quite iffy. <laughs> um, uh, okay, yeah, I was going to say, I hope I don't use all of my resources just for this dumb basement, but I think we should be good. And somehow, by mistake, I have created a little spot for a staircase, uh, which will be good because uh, I'll need that in the long run. So let's do the flooring right here. And yes, I'm making it too tall intentionally. Um, well, because, you know, it's an old castle. So everything in it will intentionally be a little a little weird because you know building techniques weren't as refined um and so on and so forth but you know it's also just because we're not going to be here that much so we don't really need this to be anything more than it is let's make sure i'm on hard okay cool i was like i haven't seen a monster but i guess that's a good thing in this case let's see and then we can also set up our base of operations down here. Uh, yeah, I don't need any dirt right now. All right, yeah, let's oh, let's set up our base, a little base camp down here. So I'll do this, make a chest. Thank you, thank you. Where we can store all of this junk for building, and I might have to get a bed at some point, but eh. That is the basement. Now, in this one, I'm not going to use the, I guess, well, you know, I can, I think I'm going to, I was going to say, in this one, I'm not going to use the, like, wall trick, but I will do that. I wish there was moss stone in Minecraft, like stone, but with some you know, moss on it or a little, a little bit of a broken up texture, but I guess that's andesite. Um, yeah, <laughs> I don't know. We'll do that. Do that. Also random thing that I noticed, uh, Greg, <laughs> yes, Greg from the village has gone semi viral, uh, in that he is, uh, I posted a video. I think I talked about this yesterday. But I posted a video uh, about Greg, and it was the one where he was spinning from my other episode, and it's on Instagram Reels, and it's got, like, I think, I don't know, like, 40,000 plays, <laughs> which is crazy. Um, so Greg, it, Greg is somewhat famous. Let's see. I think I can get away with that. Yep, perfect. So up here, I lined up, uh, you know, just kind of like what I thought would look nice. Um, oh, let me take this down here so I'm not exposed to the elements. But here I lined up what I thought would look nice in a castle. Um, and then we'll just kind of start building it out. I think, let's see. I think here in this little section, I want it to be a little roof. Uh, and I want these to be stone. So let's replace this with stone. Okay, that's fine. Oh, wait, should I do stone brick? Let's, let's try stone brick and see how that looks. Uh, put you down here. And then, wait. Okay, I don't have stone brick blocks. There we go. Let's do that. And then... Right here, right here, and right here. Don't worry, I'll light up the floor in a sec so you guys can see. There you go. And then right here, right here, and right here. And then... Hmm. How much... How high do I need to go with this one? I think with this... Middle section, it should be... Eh, this middle section, I could do two stories. So, like, one... 
So it goes three, four, then over. There we go. Something like that. Uh, yeah, you can be. There you go. Nope, didn't want that. And then, whoop, ow. There we go. And then I can obviously, you know, mark these out, make them a little different. There we go. Sweet. And then up here we can have, yeah, yeah, I'll do a little, a little two-story action. Now I don't know if I want to do. Mm, you know what? No, let's go for the two tall windows down here. Why not? Oh, okay. I was like a little nervous for a second. <laughs> there we go. And then we'll go. Yeah, we'll go up two tall. And then just kind of build the frame of this main section real quick. All right, so now that I have this section done, I'm going to do a little reverse work right here and then have a tower right here. Well, not a tower, kind of something like this almost. Oh, wait, this will be, I mean, for now I can do this, but I kind of want this to be andesite stair. But I can mix this in, nope, oh, like this, and give myself kind of like, you know, different tower levels. Uh, so this one, I can just have it be a small tower, like, okay, not like that, like this. Nope. Oh. <laughs> and then, let's see, put you right there. Put you right there. Uh, hmm. I'm trying to think. Oh, wait. Give me that. Then I can put you right here. You right there. Then around here, I can have. Hmm. Like that, maybe? I don't know. How does this... How, I need to see how this looks. Okay. Then something like that. Uh, oof. Let's see. How can I get this to look good? Uh... Slabs. Slabs are always an okay move. It's an interesting one by me, but you know what? We'll, we can deal with it. And then maybe like... Uh, hmm. How does that look from, like, if you're coming up on it? Oh, that looks a little weird. Okay. Don't know if I like that. Maybe if I just do, like... Uh, what is it? Yeah, an outline with cobblestone. Maybe that, maybe that will look okay. Uh, so, here, here, here. There. There's that. And then. Down. Ah. Okay, I'm going to need more slabs, which I think I have more down here. Sorry if I'm being quiet. I'm just trying to concentrate on... So look, I do have more slabs, which is good. All right. Okay. 
Okay, thank you for that. Okay, and then you can go there. And I can have you like this. And then uh, excuse me. Thank you. No, that's not what I wanted. Okay. And then this is like the opposite of what I just did. Something like that. Ow. And then, yeah, I can also mix in mossy cobble like this. Maybe add in some. Let's see, what does andesite look if I add it like down here? Like that. Does that blend in? Like if I do right there and then like a special does not a special design but like something like this okay yeah it breaks up the texture a little bit which I'm actually oh I'm actually cool with and then here you can have like one right here and then just one and a site down here. Oh, or maybe one up here. Nope, not that. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, just like a mix of that. You know, that looks kind of good. I might have to break up, you know, that, but eh, we'll deal with that when we come to it. But I'm going to keep doing this and then I'll fill in just kind of the main section and then I'll get right back to you. Guys, I think there's a creeper right above me. All right, let's just do this. All right, does he, did he see him? Oh, there he is. I see him. Okay, let's kill him. Come here, you. Oh, that was crazy. Oh, that was easy. Well, I've kind of finished the outline. Sorry. There we go. I think it looks good. I'm going to have to break up the uh, stone brick a little. But I think it's a nice little, like, medieval keep. Uh, obviously, right here, you know, I've got some um, <laughs> some uh, work to do. But I think having a tower right there is nice. And then somewhere I can fit in a chimney. Um, but right now, you know, I don't really need too much of anything. I can also switch in between these two blocks for little added texture. So yeah, you have it like this and then, you know, boop. And then some of them are a little more broken down than others. But I think that's a good start. Oh yes, I also need to fill in, you know, this section right here. And then, ah, I don't know. Something like that, maybe. <laughs> yeah, that'll be fine. And then... There you go. Stop that. There's, nope. Nope, nope, nope. That's not what I needed right here. Yep. Boom, boom. Boom. One, two. Boom. One, two, boom. Two, there we go. And then, yeah, we can just kind of, there you go, repeat this up. Oh, sorry about that. I guess I'll have to do most of this. Oh, wait, no, that's good. I made it too tall on each side so that we now have, you know, some space in here. Uh, okay. So the question is going to be what to do with this area right here. As I need stairs. There you go. But it's also going to be interesting in how I do this. Uh, 
right? No, because I'm going to need to do that. Oh no. <laughs> hmm. How to do. Maybe like this? Ah! Oh no, but then I can't get up. Uh, maybe then I'll just have stairs up in this tower. And then here I can just do, I don't know, like a mixture of stuff like that. Oh, sorry. You know, because it shouldn't have moss on the inside. But, yeah, something like that. And then I can have a spiral staircase up here. Which I can use... Honestly, let's use birch. We can strip it. So then it can look like uh, this right here. Excuse me. This right here. There we go. And then, well, I guess just like that. And like that. And then, you know, the spiral staircase formula. Oh. I knew it would do that. Okay. Um, let's just do, I guess, one forward. Yeah, like this. Because then this won't connect. And you can just... Okay, I guess I gotta do this way. Yep. There we go. And then just keep following the spiral staircase pattern like this. And I need more stairs. Okay, <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to do that and then we'll get to the top floor and then I'll f like put on the roofs and everything and then we'll get the glass and start decorating and kind of put in the finer details around here. All right, so I finished, get out of here. So I finished up this uh, build here. Well, at least the exterior. Now we can go ahead and add our windows in. I think I'm going to stick with the green. I kind of like the green. Uh, for these for some of these builds I think you know uh, I don't know it's kind of fitting you know it's kind of like it looks old but it's not old but it's also I don't know time adjusted if that makes sense like it blends in with um, I guess the palette that I've chosen for this. And wow, we've got so many zombies up here. Uh, torch. There you go. You know what? Let's light these up so I don't forget. <laughs> because I know I'm going to need these. Also, I'm going to have to... Yep. Well, now hold on. Okay, yeah. I was going to say, I'm also going to have to... Add a roof right here. And of course I'm going to use copper. Um, but let me finish up this little area in here. That should be good. Oh, nope. Got to get you. Okay. Then we'll come down here. To where I can get my stone cutter and cut some stairs. This is... It's so nice that you can use copper on this. I would hate... If you had to use, like, the wood structure on it. But, nope. Luckily, luckily we have we have the copper. <laughs> and then, let's see. Yep, so. Oh, no. Phantoms. Wait. Ha, ha, ha. Will they spawn back? I don't think so. I do need to sleep. It's been some time. Oh, and then I also need to get the slabs. But this is coming to an end, and honestly, it turned out great. I was a little skeptical at first, but I don't know. I just got like a sudden urge of like, I know what I want to do today. And then I just did it. Oh, there we go. See, we might not even have to. Oh, yeah, look at that. You don't even have to cut 
any more stairs, which is great. And then here, yeah, I'm just gonna do that, do that, and then there we go. We have green glass, and then up here, I'm gonna have to, you know. Oh yeah, look at that. So now we're gonna be able to see this uh, from over there. I don't know if I'm gonna keep it dark on purpose or what? <laughs> I know I'm gonna take these off the floor and, you know, light up uh, the actual, like, keep walls, like this. Uh, and up here it should be lit up, right? Yep. Cool. And then what else do I need? Hmm. A door. That'd be useful. <laughs> I'm gonna, you know, come out here and do some, oh yeah, I can do a trap door. Yeah, I've got six. I was gonna say, I'm gonna come out here and, you know, do some, oh, the uh, stair slabs. Yeah, let's do those. Oh, and then, oh, perfect. I can just get up here, you know, normally. All right, let's see. And then I, yep, perfect. And then I come down here, ow. And then just place these right here. You know, just a little something something to add to it. And then I can just get back in here like this. Thank you. Ah, sweet. Okay, now everything is sealed off except for this, which I kind of want a spruce door for out here. So I'm gonna go grab that and then we'll do the little details out front and then we'll take kind of a, yeah, we can get like a screenshot and, ooh, and maybe I can get some vines. I'll have to do that. Um, so I'll go get like the last like finishing touches stuff for it. And then, you know, we'll go from there. I hear a skeleton. There you are. Of course you had to come out of the ground. Look at that. Now you're on fire. You stupid idiot. Look at you die, die. Thank you. Um, Ooh, give me those bones. <laughs> yeah, so I'm going to get those last little bits of stuff. And then I think we can call it a day, which is good because, you know, yeah. I don't know. This was just a really fun build that I wanted to do. <laughs> and now we've done it. All righty. Now I have everything for the final details on the exterior. I will use, um, I'll do the interior, you know, some other time. Uh, just because, like I said, I, I just wanted to build something that was like a little cool, you know, something that, you know, wasn't like too, oh God. Okay. <laughs> wasn't like too crazy, but also just something that was fun. You know, it's important to remember in your Minecraft worlds when to have fun, you know, when to do whatever. Stuff like that. Okay, don't put one over the door. I learned my lesson that way. Oh, hello. There you go. So we can just spread out some vines and things like this. Like I said, I didn't want this to be abandoned. More, I wanted it to be like a little overgrown. You know, nothing too crazy. Eh, eh, like, eh. Eh. Like stuff like this, you know, nothing too crazy. And then obviously for around here, we can, you know, bone meal this area. It's, I guess it's supposed to be a little unkempt. Unkempt? Is that the right word? I don't know. But you know what I mean? Just like a little overgrown, nothing crazy. Like, yeah, it's, you know, still got light, uh, but no one's really going anywhere in it and stuff like that. Like no one actively lives in it. No one, you know, keeps a record. No one keeps track of it. And it's kind of fallen into a little bit of a, ow, what the, oh, <laughs> it's kind of fallen into a little bit of a state of disrepair. And I'm hoping I can get a good picture of it. If I come up here, there we go. 
And then, let's see, zoom in a little. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at that, lovely. Well, that I think is just swell. And then if you come out over here, yes, and I just said that's just swell. Like, cause you can't see it from the road really. It's like kind of hidden back there. Um, and then also if I come up into the tower, you know, we'll be able to see it from here. I mean, you can kind of see it from certain angles, but that's the beauty of it is it's not out in your face. It's not like, ah, oh, look at me. It's just a small little keep um, that, you know, doesn't really serve any purpose. <laughs> I mean, just like a lot of these buildings, like, yeah, I have the villagers uh, that live in some of them, but they don't really serve a purpose outside of just looking nice. And here, you know, you can see it right over there. But like, again, it's not like it's buried in the trees, like. You can pass it easily and you know, there's a little pathway to it. There's the bridge um, and stuff like that. So I don't know, it's something that's really cool. I like it and I think it turned out great. Let me know what you think. Uh, leave a comment and let me know if you like it. But anyway, guys, thank you for watching today's episode. I know it was a little whimsical and a little uh, improvised, but honestly, that was the most fun I've had. Uh, this week uh, you know i always love doing small builds like that so please remember to leave a like if you like the video leave a comment let me know what you think about the video let me know what i should do next episode and subscribe if you're new i post videos every monday wednesday and friday with streams and other videos thrown randomly in between until next time this has been back to beta days i'm beanin thanks for watching peace